everyone, this is Jason J, and today, this is a little video for you guys about the cracked apps for, um, for the iTunes, like, people are getting arrows from seeking their apps to, uh, their iPod. Well, basically, I'm going to show you how to fix that arrow. Now, basically, once you sync, like, download from installers like, off your computer, and you want to sync the applications to your iPod Touch, you get an arrow, 165, it's, it's just like a number or something I don't know but it's an error but basically I'm going to show you guys how to fix that so go ahead and open up your Cydia and you do need to jailbreak on iPod touch slash iPhone alright and go to manage because you have to add a source you want to go to sources edit add and you want to add this www dot sin full i iPhone uh, repo dot com slash once you add that hit the add source alright so basically once you get done adding that you want to go into your search your search bar and you want to type this in now it's like it's only running on like it only works for 3.0 and 3.1.2 this is what the air is going on. So basically, you want to hit type in app sync. And there we are. Yeah, like I said, it's only working for 3.0 and 3.1. Um, so you have to be on one of them two firmwares. Um, basically, if you had 3.0, install that one. If you had 3.1.2 or 3.1. Point one, you install 3.1. All right, so basically, once you get that installed, go ahead and sync. We'll try syncing the applications on to the iPod Touch, and it will basically work. Now, basically, I have applications called Beatmaker. I was trying to sync it one day, and it wouldn't go. So basically, I was searching through what's name Cydia one day and I found that I read the description and I said oh well there you go the problem right here but yeah I'm the JCJ and today I just showed you guys basically how to solve the problem of uh, syncing the applications onto the iPod touch um rate comment subscribe thank you and thanks for watching this video see you later